Marina Churak has taken her campaign against sexual violence to social media. This Facebook logo she designed says, I'm fighting rape culture. The message has found enormous resonance online. Around a million users in Brazil, including suspended President Dilma Rousseff, have posted it to their profile page. Women are used to dealing with machismo. But the gang rape here in Rio has really tipped things over the edge. The huge amount of online solidarity reflects this frustration. It's only really coming to light now. But the fight isn't just taking place online. Today, Marina's attending a protest against sexual violence in the center of Rio. The gang rape of a 16-year-old girl, captured on video and shared online, sent shockwaves across Brazil. As women, we've either experienced sexual violence or had friends who've been victims of it. Sexual violence is a reality for women. That's why this issue has spurred so many people to take action. We want this reality to be recognized and for women's voices to be heard. Thousands of people have turned up to protest. Many of them are young women who say change can't come fast enough. A woman is raped every 11 minutes in Brazil. Marina says young people need to be educated about sexual violence. Children and young people should learn to understand the opposite sex. We need to start talking about sexual violence against women early on. That's the only way to change the rape culture. The public outrage has prompted the government to take some action. Those found guilty of gang rape will now face longer jail terms. But Marina fears Brazil's new conservative lawmakers aren't committed enough to stamping out sexual violence for good.